Hey everyone, and welcome to Let's Play Medal of Honor Underground. My second Let's Play, and it happens to be on the sequel for the first game I played. Strange, huh? Well, that's how it worked out. This is the main menu screen, and as you can see, everything is hidden behind something else to give you the feel of being in the French Resistance and stuff like that. Here we have a new game thing where we can start a new game. We'll be doing that shortly. And here are the options where we actually have something to do. Passwords, audio, controller, difficulty. We are going to put it on medium. Because I feel like that's adequate. Easy is, well, easy. Multiplayer, nothing there for us. The gallery, of course, makes its triumphant return. But unfortunately, it's empty. Nothing there. We'll be back for it. And inside this barrel is our save, load, and records. We have our mission log, which first mission occupied. Getting that shortly. New game. Personal records, which are completely empty. See? Just bare. And even our even our like stats are just zeros everywhere. So clean and crisp. Let's go fill those numbers up. Without further ado, let's get started. Opening cutscene time. Bonsoir, Manon. I'm sorry to call you over on such short notice, but we have an important new mission. Remember that Danish boy who lives below me? You know, Nils, the one who keeps asking me about the resistance. He's always saying that he wants to join because his home country is occupied just like France. I didn't think he was serious, but tonight he's brought me a tip that we should definitely take advantage of. Look at that candle. Remember how the Nazis took over the Paris Academy of Music and started using it as a makeshift It's hypnotic. Armory? Neil said that they are transferring a whole truckload of ordnance later Ooh, tonight. Oh, that looks nice. There to the Gestapo field office in Dubuisson. He stole a copy of the manifest and showed it to me. How thoughtful the of him. The would be carrying crates of ammunition, explosives, small arms, and even a few heavy machine guns. Mm. Just the kind of supplies we need to restock our weapons cache. I will need you to be my lookout tonight while I hijack the truck. It should be fairly simple since the Germans won't be expecting us. When this is all over, we may have a new member for our little resistance team. As always, if we get separated, head for the catacombs and meet up with the people there. I don't want to go Tell into the catacombs. And they will help you. There are dead people there. It's getting late. We'd better move out. I'm not even going to try to do a French accent anymore. I'm just going to do whatever accent this happens to be. Manon, ma petite. Thank you for deciding to help us on our midnight raid. The ever-increasing Nazi presence in the city has made it more and more difficult for the resistance to get its hands on much-needed supplies. Acquiring this truck full of ammunition and explosives will no doubt strengthen our cause. Thanks to the Vichy regime, Petain's French police thugs, the Milice, will be out in force. I'm giving you a pistol and a few petrol bombs. Please be careful, sister. I'll meet you beneath the Eiffel Tower, and from there it's just a short path from the park to the academy, where the supply truck should be waiting. I should be able to get us into the building, but I need you to provide cover fire while I'm working on the locks. Once we get to the truck, you open the garage door, and we'll drive out into the countryside. If anything should go wrong, head to the underground catacombs. We have friends there who will keep you safe. That's British. I know that's British. Ooh. I like that. I like that opening poster. You know, that loading poster, if you will. The Arc de Triomphe in the background. It's nice. Oh, our good friend, the Walther. What's that? It's a fountain, and it makes noise. Wow. Bam! Headshot! Wow, it makes noise. They didn't have to do that, but they did. Oh. It's the Eiffel Tower, and it looks all two-dimensional. Footsteps. I can only mean you. Ouch. You're dead. All right. Curse you. Giving me my first hit of the game. What? Ah! Die? All right. What do you give me? Pistol rounds. I'm fine with that. Hey there. Oh, that was nice. That was better. Pistol rounds. 
Hey. It's the Eiffel Tower, I think. Or it's a big black wiry thing. Headshot. Wow. These guys are so easy to headshot. Just because I have the pistol, of course. Okay, maybe not. Okay. What'd you give me? Where are you? Where's your gun? There it is. A petrol bomb. Pistol rounds. And there's my brother. Manu, you came. There isn't much time. Talk me and watch your back. Militia are everywhere. Just look at this countryside. It's so incomplete. <laughs> yeah, trees are the same. You shoot them, the bullet hole's just right there. Luckily, brother can kill everything in like two hits. Because he has an MP40 and he's pretty good with it. Didn't even have a chance. I got this one, brother. Or not. Stop. Okay. I guess you can do that. I had him, right? I had him perfect. And you just had to screw it up. I know you're waiting there. I'm busy, brother. Brother under attack. Well, he can take care of himself. Alright. Ouch. Take that. Give me your pistol round. Oh, or not. Okay. Hey there! Alright, you take him. Pistol rounds. Go on. Open that door. Anyone behind us? Other than an announcer? Nope. Open faster, brother. Please. Don't wipe the sweat off your brow. Let's go in. Do, 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 do. In the art school. There's a door. You must open it. Footsteps. Oh, no. No? What are you doing? What are you shooting? You're shooting through the wall. Good luck there. I'll stop the truck. I'll open the gate. I'm busy, brother. I know the door can't be open. I didn't try to open it. He's in the truck. There's a switch. Let's press it. Bon voyage, brother. Good luck with that truck. It's a trap. What? Brother. No. No. Why, you bastards? Ah. Uh, why, brother? Why? Why? Uh, okay. Dramatic moments over. Let's go to the catacombs. Honor the fallen. I like how Manon's fighting a, fighting a bunch of half tracks with a pistol. Excellent. Sixty percent accuracy. Mad Hatter. Bunch of headshots. It's all good. Continue. If you are reading this, your attempt to steal munitions did not go as planned. Jacos was always rather impetuous and inclined to trust, and now it seems like a Gestapo are onto us. Our group, Combat, that's a really imaginative name, has been using the catacombs to move personnel and supplies, and now we soldiers of the night must evacuate. Fortunately, we have planned for our eventual discovery. With this note, you will find several detonators and a Sten submachine gun. The Sten ammo should be compatible with the MP3008 weapons that the Germans will be using. The Gestapo and Vichy's Melisse brutes have been coming through the crawl spaces that connect to the streets above. Each entrance is above the main level of the catacombs, and moonlight will be visible through them. We have explosives placed ready to do the work. Detonate them by pressing the action button at the spots marked with a red box and stand clear. We also need you to secure some forged papers hidden behind a crawl space marked by the resistance symbol. Then, sneak through the sarcophagus room to find an exit leading to a mortuary, where an ex-collaborator awaits burial outside Paris. Take his place in the hearse, and one of our agents will get you to the Saint Maurice des Champs, where you should be safe until the heat dies down. I don't like the catacombs, but we go there next video. See you later.